Six. A local eighth grader's decision to wear a dress at school got him a meeting in the dean's office. The Cherry Creek School District says the outfit was causing a safety issue, but the boy's parents, they say he was unfairly treated. Denver 7's Mark Boyle reports on the dress behind this mess. What would you do if your son wore this, a black dress, to school? That's what one Laredo Middle School student did. A gender identity conversation born out of a $5 bet. It was shocking to me that the staff members took the stance that they did. I just came to school and they had it, and I put it on. You know, I wasn't really expecting much out of it. And this is the dress. Gavin Simonetti says he was bet five bucks to wear a dress to school, so he did. Yeah, there was a group around me. They, they were laughing at it, yeah, but as soon as we got in school, it all pretty much ended. But Gavin says when that crowd gathered, the dean quickly stepped in. The district says they had safety concerns and says pulled him aside, asking him to take the dress off. Then Gavin says administrators made fun of him. She said, look, he's in here. And then she just came in, looked at me and laughed and then walked away. The Cherry Creek School District says their policy allows anyone to wear what they choose so long as it isn't deemed disruptive or potentially disruptive to the classroom. Now, as a student not concerned about his gender identity, he's standing up for those who might be. I'm hoping that it tells them that they don't have to be scared to be who they want to be. Uh, I don't want them to, you know, feel terrified in their own school to, you know, express who they are and how they feel. Gavin says students at the school are standing behind him. Now others are urging everyone to wear dresses to school on Thursday, which Gavin has plans on doing again. In Aurora, Mark Boyle, Denver 7.